Now the teams, they actually have to fund their own uh, project, I guess. Uh, are they going to outside companies or are they doing fundraisers or people of the dot-com you know, background, right. are they using their own wealth? How so, are they funding so, it? So fundraising is one of the biggest challenges, if not the biggest challenge for a team. Mm -hmm. If you look at prizes throughout history, including the Ansari X Prize, the first prize we, we won, Typically, you'll see that serious teams, and, and usually the winning team, has actually spent more than the prize value trying to win the prize. Uh, so for this prize, we fully expect that most of our teams, although not all of them, are gonna need to fundraise you know, 30, 50, maybe even more than that, more than $50 million. Uh, that's a tough task for anyone to take on, especially when you're doing something so new uh, as private lunar exploration where you can't really point to uh, other models. You can't say, well, you know what Coca-Cola did, I'm gonna do that. Uh, and it doesn't immediately cook in the minds of, of uh, of you know, venture capitalists and things like that. Uh, but teams are, are tackling this problem in a variety of different ways. A number of them are going out to you know, angel investors and high net worth individuals. They're going to venture capitalists. Uh, but they're also going to corporations and they're saying this is a unique sponsorship opportunity. You know, if you want to show the world that you care about science and technology, that you care about innovation, uh, you can attach your brand name to this mission and, and when ultimately you know, we're the ones who are successful and we'll be broadcasting an image back from the surface of the moon and everyone's going to know that it couldn't have happened without the support of your corporation. So people are looking at that, uh, but a number of people are also looking at you know, sort of new innovative uh, models that really couldn't exist without the internet. Things like they're basically open sourcing their, their, their fundraising. They're asking for small micro donations. They've got a donate button uh, on, the, on their website or they're counting on people to you know, buy a $30 t-shirt or something with $20 of that money going to support this effort. And they're figuring if, you get, you know, if we get 500,000 people to give us 20 bucks each, you know, that's, a, that's a nice chunk of change that gets us, uh, gets us started. So they're getting creative. They're getting creative, absolutely. <laughs>